Hello people, this is Marky and welcome again to my channel. And today, ituturo ko sa inyo yung, uh, yung fish balls ko na recipe. Since everyone um, is in quarantine, sobrang lahat siguro na miss yung street foods. And together with my fish balls, ituturo ko din sa inyo how simple gumawa ng sweet sauce. Yung manong padagdag ng sauce, yung sauce dun sa, uh, yung sauce ni manong na masarap. Ayun, so let's start. I'm going to um, just prepare the ingredients and I'm going to show it to you. And one more thing guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, you can see my logo here, my YouTube logo. Uh, hover that and you will see a subscribe. Just click that and you will be automatically subscribed. Let's start. Okay, so for our ingredients, what we need is chopped garlic, chopped onions, one cup flour, paprika, but however, paprika is just an option, optional siya. And then, pinagmix ko na yung, yung vegetables ko and yung fish. This is uh, the usual frozen fish na nabibili sa supermarket, but you can also use canned goods like uh, tuna or yung fresh na fish, yung mga galunggong, ganun. Basta alisin nyo lang yung, yung, um, yung, yung bones, yung, yung tinek. And then, I have a mixture of carrots and um, cabbage. Na-chop lang din sila. And then, salt and pepper for flavor. A little bit of oil. And the oil then for the frying. Okay, sorry. Na, hindi ko na mention yung one whole egg for the ingredients. So don't forget this. Okay, so for the procedure, imimix lang natin sila, uh, everything sa bowl. Nagtira ako ng konti for my sauce later. And then, put your flour. I-mix nyo lang siya until mag-incorporate na siya. Pwede nyo siyang lagyan ng konting tubig para lang magbasa-basa na ganito. Pag feeling nyo dry ah. Depende sa consistency na gusto nyo. And just season it with salt and pepper. And the paprika. I think I need to add some water in here. We only want this texture, this uh, consistency, because we don't want it uh, too runny, or ayo natin siya masyadong matubig, kasi mahirap siyang emold for later, for frying. So I'm just gonna chill this one, and then we're going to prepare um, the, the sauce. Okay, so what we need for the sauce is one cup water, two tablespoon flour, yung natira natin na bawangan si buyas, six cups of sugar, and then season it with salt and pepper. Okay, so for the uh, procedure natin for the for the sauce, I mix yung lahat lang dry ingredients. And then, in a saucepan, ito, ihalo lang, i-heat up natin ng medium heat. So, ihalo na natin yung, yung bawang natin ng sibuyas. And yung dry mixture natin. And for the color, lagyan lang natin siya ng So that's two and a half uh, tablespoon of soy sauce. Isimmer nyo lang to hanggang maging thicken. And so as you can see, malapot na siya. So patayin na natin yung heat. And it's done. Ganun kabilis. Basta, ano lang, patience lang talaga. 
Kasi patience is a virtue. Okay, so we're done with the sauce. Magiinit naman tayo ng ating pan, another pan for uh, the fish balls. Okay, so magluluto na tayo ngayon ng ating fish balls. Maginit lang kayo ng pan, medium heat, and then lagyan nyo na ng inyong uh, oil, yung frying oil ninyo. Ayan siya, ganyan. Haluin nyo muna to. Sobrang dali lang nitong uh, mer ano, recipe na to. As in. Nilakas ko na yung oil para ma-meet niya yung init. Okay, so mainit na yung ating uh, oil. Nilagay ko na din sa medium heat. Nagawin lang natin dito is ibo-balls natin siya. Kumuha ko ng another spoon para ma-form natin siya ng balls. Ito niyo yung flow. And then, dip it there. Ayun, so importante guys na pag, um, pag nagluluto kayo, don't, uh, pag nagdi-deep fry kayo, don't overcrowd your, um, yung mga fried items sa loob para mabilis sila maluto and mamit nila agad yung init. Kasi lahat ng overcrowded, masama. Okay, so mag-prepare ako ng another plate for the cook items and nalagyan natin siya ng Absorb, uh, absorber na tissue kasi yung iba malapit na maluto okay so luto na siya pag ganyan niya yung kulay niya pero kung gusto niyo mas, uh, mas crispier pa wala namang problema it's your call yan luto na yung first batch nilagay niyo lang din ganun lang din pa ulit ulit So, sa may mga kids dyan, pwede nyo itong gawin sa, sa kanila and hindi nila makikita yung, yung um, vegetables. Pwede din kayong gumawa ng chicken or ng meat. Hindi, hindi na siya fish balls. Tawag na doon, meat balls or chicken balls. Heh, <laughs> balay. Okay guys, so for the plating, what we need is um, uh, this glass, yung, yung transparent, or pwede kayong gumamit yung usual na glass na ginagamit sa mga street foods. And the stick, gusto ko to para ma-feel ko naman yung street foods vibe. So, lagay lang tayo dito ng fish balls. Ayan, di ba? Lagyan lang natin siya ng sauce. Isa pa. Gusto ko yung parang may umaabaw na feeling. Ayan na siya. Super easy, super dali, budget friendly na street food style. Uh, fish balls with manong sauce. Let's taste it. Tagdagan ko pa ng konting sauce. Okay guys, nakatapos na naman tayo ng isang dish. Ito na siya. Yay! <laughs> feel na feel ko talaga yung street foods. Kaya dito ko siya nilagay. Tikman natin. Nang sarap ng sauce. hindi na ako magsalita sa akin. So, yun. Accomplish na naman tayo sa fish ball with sweet manong sauce. Sweet manong sauce. 
So yun guys, so I hope you guys enjoy it and sana itry nyo yung recipe. So if you haven't subscribed yet, hover my um, YouTube logo and you will see a subscribe para updated kayo. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Ubus ko na. Thank you guys for watching. Bye bye. Stars, I'm a fool for your love.